And hey guys, so yes, so in this video what I'll be talking about is mistakes you are most likely probably making, yes, and hopefully this will actually help you out to progress in the game more and stuff like that. But right, so before I actually do get into the video, make sure to like and subscribe as we're trying to hear about 67k subs and also let's try and hit 100 likes, but right. Mistake number one, and let's actually do this inside the ticket tent. Yeah, it kind of takes place here because the first thing, as you guys do see here, when you go straight down, you do see a cub buddy over here. And well, the first mistake is actually buying the cub buddy with tickets because, first of all, I mean, you can literally get it from B Bear for free a free cub buddy over here, yes, but you can also get one from Brown Cub and stuff. And mostly, it's kind of a waste of tickets. How much does it cost? Cost. It costs 2,000 tickets. You're just wasting tickets. You might as well just buy a star tree at that point. And since we're also talking about star treats and stuff, do not use a star tree on your basic B. You could literally just buy a bunch of these basic eggs, yeah, and just use them like a couple times, maybe more than a couple times, but it'll work at one point and your basic B will come out gifted at one point, by the way. Then mistake number three still got something to do with the ticket 10 and that is actually buying all your events before you can even gift one event B. I mean, what's the point when you can't even have one event B gifted and you're already buying a new event B? Mistake number four now, and that is actually using festive beans for loot. Yeah, festive beans. I mean, just telling you guys right now that you guys are really gonna regret it whenever you actually do get to like level 15 hive or whatever, like probably more actually but you know what I mean anyway you're gonna want to have a you know nice little boost inside of some field well not little but a big boost and oh you ran out of festive beans I wonder why maybe because you wanted to stack up on that one gingerbread bear yeah so definitely do not do that mistake number five is actually using stingers before buying the demon mask because you're probably going to want to buy the demon mask at one point since oh yeah you want to go you know red hive or something you want to do good in the robo challenger for example and you're gonna run out of stingers because you kept using them for no reason really because you're gonna you know try to kill the coconut crab for some reason and your bees aren't even gonna do that much damage anyway so there's no point and you're also gonna want to buy the vicious bee as well so you know no point using stingers early. Okay, so mistake number six now or seven, not really too sure, lost track already, but it is actually going a red or white hive at like level 12, 11, 15, whatever like that. I mean, you're not gonna make a lot of honey, that's the first thing, because you don't even have the facilities for it, you know what I mean? Because of, you know, your SSA, your amulets, stuff like that, your beehive. And then second of all, I do actually recommend going blue hive, because you're just gonna do better i mean even if you can't macro you can just save up honey get good at everything you know make sure you actually have good ssa your hive is good and stuff good bees everything gifted a good level and stuff before you do actually switch to a proper hive color then you can actually learn and, and do good at that hive color you do actually want to be the next mistake is actually getting windy b at the start when you're quite early mid game sort of I guess because well the first thing is you're obviously not gonna be able to get windy B if you donate it because it's just gonna take you too long unless you're crazy lucky but I doubt that's gonna happen so just go for like you know petal one petal belt whatever you want really the next thing is actually something to do with the diamond mask and yes that is saving your diamond eggs and well that is kind of because I know a lot of you guys do like to spend the diamond eggs and all kinds of eggs really that also goes to the next mistake using star eggs yeah do not use star eggs like just wait till all of your bees and stuff are in your hive gifted I'm pretty sure yeah then just use the star eggs later when you can actually use them to get mythic bees for free gifted wow no way so yeah just don't use star eggs or any kinds of eggs and do not use mythic eggs by the way and that is because what you can actually do is 
donate them to the wind shrine later on when you are quite more you know advanced and stuff you know level i don't know 18 for example that's just random when you're actually boosting same thing goes you know festive being just a bit different you're gonna want to use it in a boost instead of actually you know using it in inside of a field but i said that before already the next mistake is actually buying sprouts with tickets yeah it's really just a waste if i'm being honest like look at this 200 tickets for 10 magic beans why are you doing this bro 10 magic beans 200 tickets like that is actually crazy okay so for now that is actually all the mistakes well the thing is about that actually if i haven't actually answered your question i'm going to be active in the comments and try and help you guys out and actually try and solve your problem if you if you do actually have one and you don't know and you are still confused on what to actually do so yeah just let me know in the pinned comment and yeah thank you so much for watching and bye